Hey guys, so this is what it gives me. It's not straight, straight like I wanted, like straight like this, but it's getting there. And by the way, you don't really want it that straight. You still want to have some curves in your hair. Um, I'm making my curling iron kind of heat up. So, I'm going to top something else than here. Why not about the um, outfit of the day? Now, whoops, the wrong side. Okay. Okay, so the outfit of the day is actually this. I'm wearing this right now. It's, um, it's a nice uh, V-shaped, here, right here, it's a nice V-shape. Um, it's, it's like a, not like, um, dress, it's a little bit, um, short for a dress, but it has like this nice dress length. It's like that. You can put it with a belt. That's why it has like these little things right here. But I'm going to cut that off. Um, you can wear this with leggings. I'm wearing it with gladiator sandals right now. I don't know if you will be able to wear gladiator sandals. You won't be able to see them, but these are the sandals. They're really nice. I got these for fifty dollars. And yeah, this is the makeup. It's like like I'm wearing black and white. First, I did a black coat right here. It's kind of coming off, but I used a black eyeshadow, and I just, you know, make it dark right there. There you go. It's because the dark kind of weared off the black. Sorry, kind of wear it off. But you can reapply, you know. I, I didn't put primer, but it kind of wear it off. That's the reason why you couldn't see the black. But there it is. Um, so first I applied black on my lid. Then I took a shade stick, um, like a... Um, a shimmery gray grayish shade stick and I put it all around my crease and on the lid like on the inner outer corner of the lid and then I took a liquid eyeliner and I just went all the line of my lashes coming out to do a little wing I put mascara And I didn't put anything below because I wanted to look, I didn't want to look that heavy. So I mixed like a black, grayish, smoky eye. Then on my lips, I just put like a peachy, peach orange color from Avon. And it's this one. Swatch. Ooh, it's broken. Let's give you a light swatch. On the product, it has this lip glossy feeling. It's a two in one lipstick, it has lip gloss in the tube mixed with the lipstick and gives like that peachy color, like orange peachy color. Then I pop, put some blush, I put my foundation, I put some loose powder with my powder brush. 
um, some homemade foundation matches really good with my skin. I know it looks junky and gross, but it makes my skin even. It's really nice. Mm. So, yeah. Um, I have to go do my brows again because they're kind of full once more. Um, so, that's what I used. Oh, and for accessories, I just have a ring on my pinky. Just to make it, you know, simple. Because my hair is also going to be dramatic. So this is hot enough. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my... Um, okay, so I'm guessing we have the time to do the first layer. So I'm just going to separate my hair again. Okay. I just want to separate it, you know. Get your brush. Sorry. Get your brush. Hmm. And start brushing. What you want to do is you want to take this much of hair. Take your glove because it is going to be hot so take a glove put it on I didn't have the time to do one strap um, take your curling iron hold it for about a few seconds Open and release, and we'll give you this nice curl. So you just want to do it like about the second half, because you don't want like you don't want a lot of curls, you know. You just you don't want to do the whole hair of curls. You just want to do a couple of curls. So I don't actually op clamp, clamp and roll, I just roll in the exterior, I don't know, it makes more loose curls and makes them more, you know, unique and pretty. Um, so I'll show you what it gives when you actually clamp it, go down, just twist. This is what it's going to give you. I don't know. I don't really like it. Um, uh, I haven't tried by clamping. I always done my hair out in the exterior. Just checking how much time there's left. Leave it, I'm leaving it there for a long time because I don't know what it's going to give me. So this is the curl that it's going to give me it's not, not that special you know just a simple curl because this is a small curling iron I am planning on buying a bigger one because I don't know I think I like it better clamping and that will do the last one. So I'm running out of time, girls. Um, I'll give you the comparison on a clamped curl and on a loose curl. I'll cut it right here. Just because the time is going to finish any soon. Thank you. Um, look out for part three, okay?